stormed her way through Sydney's gay underworld and built herself an empire of drag clubs, car parks, steam rooms and sex shops. Dawn married twice, once to a man and then to a woman. The convent girl turned ice skater became the godmother of Sydney's Golden Mile, Oxford Street. She adored drag queens and many started their careers in Dawn's pubs. Hi girls, how are you? People like to see people live. And I mean, you get a good drag queen, you get somebody that's got, a, got their hand on a microphone. I mean, they can entertain people for hours. I think Dawn always liked drag. I think she also liked drag because it made her money. Dawn's world gave me the material. And people said, oh, where did you come out um, with all, you know, these great ideas, all these great one-lines? And it was sort of like sitting in Dawn's pubs listening. Why don't you lunch or tan on and blow your box apart? She was, you know, a, a cutthroat businesswoman and she, you know, if you crossed her, she'd slit your neck and bury you in carpet up in the Blue Mountains. And, you know, that was, that was sort of what you heard about her. She was a ruthless businesswoman. But did she run brothels? Did she commit arson? Did she, or didn't she, murder? 